In this problem, we're asked to add the given polynomials. Then we're asked to subtract the second polynomial from the first. In part A, to add the given polynomials, we simply add parentheses t squared plus 6t minus 9 plus parentheses t squared plus 7t minus 3. Notice that I used parentheses around the polynomials. This is a good habit to get into, even though the parentheses will not affect the addition. Next, we simply add the like terms. t squared plus t squared is 2t squared. 6t plus 7t is 13t. And negative 9 minus 3 is negative 12. So we have 2t squared plus 13t minus 12. In part b, we're asked to subtract the second polynomial from the first. So we have parentheses t squared plus 6t minus 9 minus parentheses t squared plus 7t minus 3. Notice that the second polynomial is subtracted from the first. And again, notice that we use parentheses around each polynomial. Now, it's important to understand that the minus sign outside the second set of parentheses can be thought of as a negative 1. So we need to distribute the negative 1 through each of the terms in the second set of parentheses. So, after rewriting our first polynomial, t squared plus 6t minus 9, we have negative 1 times t squared, or negative t squared, negative 1 times positive 7t, which is negative 7t, and negative 1 times negative 3, which is positive 3. Now, we combine like terms t squared minus t squared cancels out. Positive 6t minus 7t is negative 1t, or negative t. And negative 9 plus 3 is negative 6. So we have negative t minus 6. Make sure to distribute the negative 1 through the parentheses when subtracting the second polynomial from the first.